Kochura has a unique technology platform that enables us to integrate high performance passives, high speed actives, and uh, WDM capabilities together uh, to achieve uh, solutions for applications in the data center market, telecom as well as compute com applications. The CFP was a quite a remarkable achievement for its time. It offered 100 gigabit per second pipelines uh, and fitted four of these into a panel. Uh, WDM technology was used to multiplex 25 gig lines to enable us to get 100 gig. However, as you can see, uh, it has a number of disadvantages associated with it. One is that it's quite large. The other is that it consumes a lot of power and it was also quite expensive. Compared to the CFP, the QSFP offers significant advantages. As is fairly straightforwardly obvious, it's much smaller. You can fit up to 24 of these inside the panel of a data center compared to only four of the CFP. If you double up the density, you can fit up to 48. This means you can get up to 10 times the bandwidth into a panel uh, at a data center. Now, it consumes far less power, almost a factor of 10 also, and it still gives you the same amount of bandwidth. With Kachura's technology, we are able to integrate all the associated functionalities that are needed in a QSFP into silicon photonics chips that are enabling us to offer much lower cost and much lower power. All the required functions are integrated into the silicon photonic chips except for the laser. And Katura has a very low cost uh, technology that enables us to flip chip the lasers into the silicon platform. And that has enabled us to therefore come up with extremely cost effective solutions for the data center 100 gigabit per, per second Ethernet applications. The beauty of a WDM solution is that we can easily uh, scale up the aggregate bandwidth into a single fiber from the existing 100 gigabit per second solutions to 400 gigabit per second solutions or maybe 1.6 terabit per second. Um, our technology enables us to offer uh, data rates as low as 25 gig all the way up to perhaps 100 gig in the longer term. We use data rates that the electronic industry are comfortable with. For, for example, today the electronic industry is scaling up to 25 gig per second in the future, we could go up to 50 or maybe even 100. On the WDM side, we can scale up from four channels that we are utilizing today to 40 channels or maybe even 80 channels in the longer term. This way, we have a very elegant solution to offer very high aggregate bandwidths into a single fiber that can easily scale to a terabit or beyond 1.6 terabit per second. At the heart of our WDM optical engine lies um, a shell grating that does the multiplexing or demultiplexing of the different wavelengths. We also use uh, electroabsorption modulators and germanium-based detectors that are capable of running at very high speeds and are very efficient. Our laser approach enables us to use an external cavity structure that enables us to register the wavelengths extremely accurately and therefore offer a very dense WDM solution. All these combined enables us to attack a number of applications in the data center market for uh, data center fabric or for connecting the different routers or switches together.